What do you think, buddy? Should we teach them another card trick they can do? Everybody wants to learn card tricks, don't they? Yeah. Everywhere we go, people ask me to do a card trick, do a card trick. So I'm going to teach you a fun one that you can do. If you can grab an envelope and a piece of paper, you can do this at anybody's house with anybody's cards. But we're going to do it right now using an envelope that we put a question mark on because I made a prediction. I know which card Xander's going to end up with before he even knows. We're just going to set it right there so everybody can watch it. Now here we have a deck of cards and we can mix them up all we want. It's better if you have your friend mix it. Go ahead buddy, we're going to make some piles here, make a few piles. You can do that, put some on the top, pick up some and mix them up. Come on, make them, make them all mixed up for me, all right? So you can do some more if you want. You can let them mix as much as you want, okay? Then you even let them go ahead and straighten them up. Go ahead, make them nice and neat. Now remember, I predicted what card my friend would pick. It's right here in this envelope, right? No one's touched the envelope, have they, buddy? No, you just tell them to keep their eyes on the envelope. You pick it up, flip it over, pull out the paper. It says the nine of spades. Xander, you see that top card? Will you just flip it over for me? Just the top one, just the top one. No, not all of them, buddy. Just the top one. Watch. Nine of spades. It matches. We did magic. Xander and I will now teach you how to do the card prediction trick. What you need is an envelope, a piece of paper, and a deck of cards. That's it. You can do this trick anywhere. The secret is I write down the name of a card, put it in the envelope. It's really in there. But underneath the envelope, I have the card that matches my prediction. So I keep that together as I show this. I just hold it underneath. I can show it, I set it down. Usually I set it on the edge of the table so I can pick up the card easily. They can mix up the deck of cards all they want, make a mess, whatever they want. Have them straighten it up. Then you pick up the envelope with the card underneath it and just put it on top. So I'm just setting that card right down on top. They don't know it's under there. Set it down. You talk for a minute about the envelopes been on the table. You pick up the envelope. You pull out your prediction, which was the nine of spades. You then flip over the top card. Better yet, let them flip it over if they don't flip over all of them. They pick up just the top one, turn it over, and you say, look, you stopped on the same card that I predicted ahead of time. You mix them up as much as you want, but you found the same card. You will fool your friends with this one, and it's so easy to do. Just grab yourself an envelope, piece of paper, deck of cards, steal off one card, hide it under the envelope, let them shuffle it, put it on top. Pretty easy. And what I would do is if you repeat this, maybe have a couple different ones, but you know the rule in magic, never repeat tricks for the same people over and over again. So Xander and I are having fun teaching you magic tricks. I hope you are having fun learning them. This is Xander. This is Christopher. Thanks for watching and keep practicing. I got it. You did get it. Great job. Thumbs up.